We're gonna talk to a rock. We sure are. Finally came, Lamp. Finally, you talk to me. Listen, Lamp. Oh, I could have healed here! <laughs> the fucker, I want my $400 back! I can tell you something oh. very important. They want to take notes. Ready? You are the chosen one. Your destiny is not only yours, it's the destiny of the whole universe. There will be a time in which all of you in the universe will overlap each other. It's not necessary to understand now. You remember Giant Stephanonet? That is one of your sanctuary. It is a spot which gives you power, allows you to realize your skills. There was a monster that protected it. That monster is influenced by the power of the place. You must have beaten those monsters. You must reach all of the eight power spots in the world. The sound stone records the melodies of all eight power spots. You can finally see your world. I'll tell you of all, all of the power spots. Number one, Giant Step and Own It. Number two, Lilliput Steps. In a peaceful rest valley near Tucson. Number three, Milky Well and Grapefruit Falls in Savage Valley. Number four, Rainy Circle, found by Desk in Winters. Number five, Magnet Hill at the edge of the city of Forside. Number six, Pink Cloud, which Steve knows. And seven, in Lumian Hole, where the Shining Leechen lives in the cave. Okay. Eight. A new place is now going to be opened up to you. Fire Spring, located southwest of here. Listen to the melodies of all eight power spots. If you do not fail, you may upset Gygus' plans. Understand, Lamp? Time will come. Time when the destiny of you and the whole universe will overlap. It is fast approaching. Gee, thanks. Not, not any pressure at all. So you said southwest, right? Um. So first we head west, and then we head south. You will want to get that present so that you can see it down there. Okay, am I- To go around the uh, but just make sure- You cut out massively. Ah! I'm gonna have to go down like this. Yeah. Uh, that cave- Pardon? Their first thought. You keep cutting oh. out, bud. Mother fucker. Go in the cave? Hang on. Yes. Hi, this is actually a jump Hi. cut to later on, uh, after Lucy has corrected her I... um her issue. So what were you trying to say about this area? Okay. It doesn't do anything now. You can't do anything here, but it's... But you will end up here later, and it's kind of cool if you've seen it already. Or if you've done this part already. I see. Also, you're cutting so... out again. Are you serious? No. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> uh... It is pretty cool, though. I... Yeah. But yeah, no, I'm sorry. Is... I, was, I was just fucking with you. <laughs> God. Okay. There's actually an enemy we haven't seen here. That's hilarious. Oh, is um, there? Yeah. It's it's hilarious. Um So if you run into if you run into something that looks kinda weird, maybe maybe walk up to it. Say hello. Okay. It's pretty rare. But part of why I want you to see it is because because there's this is another instance where it has fucking ridiculous official artwork. I see. Oh wait, does that get rid of the solidification? Uh, I don't. It doesn't remove status ailments. It just uh, like removes shields. Um. Ah, I see. You know, I like honestly thought that that, uh, that uh, Omega Thunder was gonna do more. Mm. What can I say? My bad. Yeah. Sweet. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have Flash Omega. 
Oh, nice. Uh, there's a pretty good chance of uh, insta killing. Not to self, use it against Gygus. I believe Gygus is the one exception, but. I can believe. Yeah. Generally, if there's a rule, Gygus is always the one exception. I see why you wanted me to have that one. Yep. We now have the complete armor set. Mm -hmm. That is the highest his defense will ever get. Uh, it will raise with leveling a little bit. The highest his defense will ever get. <sighs> okay, whatever. <laughs> I'm trying to have fun and be funny. Yeah. Actually, if... The dinosaurs don't come and attack me, so I can relax. So now I can't get out. <laughs> um... If you... want to, um... Alright, if you want to find that enemy, now's the time to do it, because uh, once you go and once you beat the next place, you will not be able to come back here. How rare is the chance that it'll spawn? Um... I don't want to keep having to dodge old purple boy over here. Yeah. Um... Um, you know what, we haven't had a, a good beast slap in a while. Oh, actually, let me try an Omega. Oh. Well, not. Um, it doesn't say how frequently they spawn. I don't know, maybe look for it a little bit, and if it doesn't show up, then, uh... Then we'll move on. Oh. I mean, I guess that works. Huh. Oh, he went numb. No, oh, paralysis. Lad, where are you, lad? Hello? Lad? Giant dinosaur friend? I this, wish... one's actually not, this one's actually not a dinosaur, surprisingly enough. Can we talk about how there are, like, actual dinosaurs? I mean, yeah, I thought that was kind of a given. Yeah, but, like, the, the dinosaurs. Never did I think that we would go from fighting little teeny tiny piles of puke to dinosaurs. Yeah, that's fair. I don't understand that one instrument in the middle of the little jazzy bit. Like the one that mm. sounds like someone smacking an electric cymbal. Hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't know. I like this theme. There's a purple boy. He. Fight the purple boy. I don't really have much of a choice there, do I? I mean, you could run. There are four of you. I could run what? You could run, there are four of you. Does it work? I I'll run it. I don't know, maybe. 
Oh. where I just give up and start heading to the uh, actual location. Yeah, if you don't see it on the way back, then we're probably then it's probably not worth it. If we don't see it on the way um, back, then you must describe it to me. Yeah, I'll send you some pictures. And bug me to actually put them in the thing this time. Mm-hmm. It's just so weird how friendly all the dinosaurs look. Mm -hmm. So if I go talk to the rock again, do I get healed? Or do I actually have to spend money again? I uh, probably don't get healed. There is another geyser close to where you're headed, so you could do that. I mean, true. Big boy. I'm gonna kill him. Aww. It's funny, when we started, you were the one upset about hurting the dinosaurs. Yeah, well, you were the one trying to get me to kill him in the first place, so I'm desensitized. <laughs> well, I guess that's what I get. It's not a dinosaur, it's a Durgan. Mm. Apparently. I didn't think I'd see a Durgan. No, it was a surprise to us all. Oh! Are you fucking kidding me? What the fuck is that? That's an ego orb. And of course it's on the fucking other side of the wall, where you can't get it. If only I had a wall hack. Yeah. I just don't bait out the geyser, I guess. Okay. Uh, it, you should probably stand on it, I think. Just stand right in front of it, and then it just... Okay, but... On the ego orb. Um... This is what it looks like... In... Battle. You want to see the official artwork for this fucking thing? In a moment. I mean, like, I, obvi uh, I can't look while we're doing the show, obviously. Yeah. But, uh... Actually, I probably could. One second. Yeah. This... Hold on. That looks like in battle. Is... is the official <laughs> artwork. It looks like a very uh, spooked moon. Yeah, remember to overlay this one, cause... Oh my god. Holy shit. Stuck on the stupid hitbox. The stupid hitbox failed me! <laughs> <sighs> you know what? I'm gonna try and run. Should work. Alright. 
Nice. Indeed. Good job. Alright. Oh boy, volatile um, fire. Yeah, look at this place. Soul consuming flame. Yep. Anything you want to tell me about this thing? It's a soul consuming flame. Oh, no specifics? Uh... Oh. Ow. Okay. Mm. Am I over leveled now? Uh... So, I'm not sure. I'm gonna kind of explore. Yeah, okay. There's nothing, like, I absolutely need here, right? Mm. There are a couple things that'll probably be useful. I mainly just did that uh, to see if I could, uh... If I could save PP. Uh, just about everything here is, uh... Weak to freeze. It's smacking, apparently. Mm -hmm. By the powers of these small children combined, Cherub's Band. Mm -hmm. That's probably useful. Uh, there's. One other thing that I would say is probably useful. So it's still being equipped on the arm. Mm -hmm. You know what? I'm gonna give it to him. I accidentally gave him the diamond band again. Now we can't be- Now we cannot be set on fire, frozen, slept, or flashed. Mm -hmm. Basically, we are indestructible. <laughs> we have powers comparable to Jesus! <laughs> Something like that, I don't know. This seems like a relatively straightforward area. <laughs> Evil Elemental. Mm -hmm. Psychic Psycho. Okay. I like the damage discrepancy. <laughs> Fire Omega. Sweet. All right. Oh. I defaulted again. <laughs> so why did that fire get called over and not the one that was actually, like, close? <laughs> mm. Um... I uh, just hit time, so... End these fuckers, and then... Oh. What does that do? 
A mini ghost. Uh. Hang on. Oh, it keeps. It, it like tried freezing me for a second. Yeah, they can do that. Okay. It's not super dangerous, but it can get pretty annoying. You saw that, right? No. It hit a smash on Steve for one damage. <laughs> That's hilarious. Ain't it? Really? Can you come down the rope? That's cheating. Yeah. That's cheating. Yeah. How do you disrupt the senses of someone who has no sense? <laughs> yeah, um... Yeah, the, uh... The ghost shouldn't hurt you too much. Um... Okay. And if you get hit with an attack that, attack that uh, will hit- that hits the entire party, then, uh... It'll just go away. Sweet. Okay, anyway, uh, okay, time to end the episode. Yeah, now we go. Goodbye! Bye!